Welcome back to Creeper World 4. So all stories end at the end, unless of course they're stories that end at the beginning or somewhere in between of the beginning and the end. Do you know what I'm saying? Because we have started this story at the beginning, but now we found ourselves at the end and every beginning has an end. This is that end. Now this mission is absolutely insane because check this out, man. We got all kinds of stuff, right? Including what seems to be a neutron reactor. Is it stable? Is it unstable? I don't know. And then we have these things. These are called air sac cauldrons. I don't know what that means. And then we have the obelisk of light here, which is uh, command and conquer has made its way into self into creeper world. Although that looks like a containment device. I don't know. Something tells me we're going to have to trigger this thing and blow up everything, right? We've also got plenty of skimmers. Guys, we are under attack. Now we've got a decent amount of uh, stuff here, right? Lots of potential mines. We've got Grenar. We've got blue white for anti creeper, red on ore. So I think we need to set our materialization coordinates here. We're going to set them right here. And then I'm going to make a quick run here for all of that. We're going to set up a mine. They call it a mine. And that is how we're going to start things out. Now, I don't know, man. Let's let's take a look. Okay. So the good thing is, is we've got this big space of land in between us. Um, wait, the land creeps now? What do you mean the land creeps? Oh my God, it's moving. What? The land is a Hacking us. Oh my god, I thought we were gonna have just all the time in the world, but it's clear that they're making land bridges. I don't know what's controlling that or how it's doing. Maybe it's the neutron reactor? Air cauldrons? Oh my god. This thing attacks in 10 minutes. Okay. Oh, and we got spores and skimmers, so we're gonna need all sorts of defenses. My god, this is gonna be crazy. All right, we're building just a ton of little towers one by one over here, because I do want access to this Grenar. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. Okay, I really need this mine. Yeah, this is kind of crazy. I think the key is to defend ourselves against blobs and uh, skimmers. We're gonna need air defense, probably a lot of snipers, I am guessing. And then let's go ahead and build an ERN portal so we can get some upgrades. Yeah, this is going to be kind of crazy when this starts attacking. Okay, let's get a few snipers and at least one missile system around our core. Okay, oh man, I need this factory and I need it yesterday. But we're doing well. Okay, wait, 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 Something, something's happening. Uh, okay, these air sac in a minute. I wonder what the air sac's all about. That's going to be really weird. And then the ground's attacking too, so this is, this is just great, you know? All of this is great. We are totally prepared for this. All right, we've got the Grenar. Need a refinery for it. Okay, I need a Terp to get these these little ERNs, which are excavated. Oh man, they're buried. Shoot, that means they're going to take a while. Okay, what is uh, a cauldron sack? In 11 seconds, we're going to find out. We need to collect the items, and the item is over here. The final info cache. Got it. I don't know what's going to happen once the land gets here, other than the creeper's obviously going to follow it in, right? Man, there's going to be a lot of blobs, and then whatever this thing is. A cauldron sack. Okay, five seconds. Mr. Cauldron Sack, excuse me, but please don't be something terrifying. Uh, okay, it's a big creeper blob. That's creepy. Okay, I'm going to see. I think it's going to be moving towards us. It seems kind of big. Uh, then I'm going to want more missiles, and then maybe some snipers. All right, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, you're not supposed to be doing that. He's dropping little bloblets. Are those bombs? Oh my God, those are creeper bombs. He's got creeper bombs. Okay, I've got to be prepared for this. Uh, and then like this is going to make beachhead against me. Oh my gosh. But we do have a decent amount of uh, mines going on right here. They call these mines. They do. Uh, <laughs> I'm not scared. You're scared. The land's moving. Oh my God, he's got even more than I thought. Oh God. Okay. Uh, How do you kill that? Hold on. I mean, I guess missiles. Most things are sniper or missiles. I think I need anti-creeper production. So we'll have these guys on always on. All right. Uh, I don't think we're ready for this thing at all. We have a ton of snipers. I have nothing defending this area over here, but maybe I can get some. There we go. Liftic is starting to power up over here, so we should have these. Okay, we've they've made landfall and this guy's attacking. This is kind of nuts. Uh, we've got a few missile systems in place and oh my God, how are we supposed to repel firepower that magnitude? This is kind of uh, insane. All right, I need a gun like right here because they're making landfall on my base. That's cool. That's really cool. We'll move this guy out of the way. Move him here. Jeez, man. We don't have near enough missiles. Well, and then we've got this giant thing attacking and skimmers at the same time. All right, so let's see. What shoots at this? How are we supposed to... Okay, snipers are killing the bomblets. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Keep sniping. Keep sniping. Keep sniping. We've almost got all the bomblets. Don't let him drop. If he drops, we are doomed. We're doomed. And... Oh, God. Creeper's already landing on... Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. The... Okay, is he still flying around? How do you kill that thing? 
And that is under attack. Oh my god. Oh goodness. Okay, I need an insane amount of weapons. Is he generating more? Okay, oh god, he's firing. But we, we hit most of them. And are we hitting him with missiles? Uh, okay, he just bombed way over there. Oh, please don't cheese me again. I hate when it cheeses. Okay, we are losing ground to the purple sludge. Well, how do you kill that? What's the what's the way to do it? Is anti-creeper even stopping it? Oh my god, everything everything is dead. Okay, we got the liftic operational, but that's not really helping us. I don't know how to stop this purple stuff because guns don't do anything. Oh, now we just lost all power. You think we can hold them? Should I have been terraforming this whole time? Well, I guess one of the things we can do is pull out everybody. Um, I mean, I guess we can try. Jeez, look at this. Okay, this is what you call freaking Mission Impossible. Everything's blowing up over here. Everything that we did have. We'll pull this guy back because why not? All right, let's put the mortars up. And they're already planning on making more landfall. Do I have to anti-terp these guys? All right, I got some upgrades. Oh man, we lost the liftic tower. We gotta pull this sniper out. He's He can't do anything over there. Oh my God, this is, this is so much. At least that blobby boy isn't around here. Look at how much creeper this is. Okay, mortars seem to be doing well. We're sniping most of these skimmers. Are we Are we gonna be able to air defense most of these? Hopefully, yes. And then we need to fight back. How? Anti-creeper's definitely helping. Oh God, here it comes again. Okay, big bomber boy's on his way. Uh, we do have a lot more snipers, I feel like. It's cool when they fire up, it loses the strand below it. I wish we could just target the top. Please don't bomb me. Oh, and the missiles just... Ooh, where are those going? Oh, those are going over, I think? Nope, some landed relatively short. But we're starting to cover ourselves with creeper. So, I think that was the key. And we're starting to push back. We gotta retake this land. But we are slowly not getting enough anti-creeper. We'll have to convert some of our mines. Oh my god, look at that! Look at that! That is incredible! It's just insane. It is insane! I mean, I guess this is the end boss level, right? So you should kind of expect that. Oh my god, is this moving still or is it kind of not moving anymore? I can't tell if this is moving and I don't know how to make it stop. Make it stop! I feel like we're running a Great Wall of China strategy here. Jeez, the amount of creeper I have to kill to get over here. I wish I could put in... Can I terraform over here? I would like to have this five. Oh god, I can't. Dang it. Okay, I can only get over there. Dang it. Oh, incoming bomblets. We lost access to that island too. I wish we could have held it. We probably could have with the right strategy. We just we just didn't have that strategy. <laughs> Look at this though. We're pushing it back. Maybe um, red can only be killed by mortars. We do need to test that out. I'm just building like... It's kind of silly. But the amount of momentum we lost was pretty incredible by losing this choke point here. It just, it was just a flood. Oh God, here he is again, the big daddy bomber. But we're definitely being able to defend him. Look at that. Th this time he got four bomblets and they should fall on. Okay, they were sniped mostly in the air. And then once he's in range, oh God, we are running an energy deficit, aren't we? Where can I pick up some extra energy? The front lines, <laughs> that's just scary. I've literally covered every area I can. Maybe I might have to convert this to energy. There we go. That is, that's what we needed. Okay. Are the mortars killing the purple? Slowly. Then what we need to do is focus on the blue creeper and flank around. It's like you're flanking. You don't, do you really flank a, a giant living fluid? Maybe you do. There will come a point though, where we at least have them in a stalemate. And I'm going to build an airfield and send them back to the stone age. I mean, they kind of are though, right? They kind of are the stone age. Ooh, that was bad. Oh my God. Look at that massive like stun. Ooh, geez. That could be hugely detrimental. Here he is again. Oh God. Oh my God. What is happening? These seeds? That is an insane amount of flooding over there. This is truly living up to like the end of the campaign, the boss level type experience. But slowly but surely we will prevail. Oh look, just because I'm gonna let the creeper know what's up. I'm gonna build one of these soon. Ha! All right, we found a way to stop this bomber guy. Missiles and snipers, although he still does get a few of them out. And covering our area with anti-creeper seems to be good, but not a perfect solution. I really thought we were done after they made landfall, but I was like, you know, I mean, what am I going to do? Not nah, try to hold on? I'm glad I held on. It's tough, though. Never, never, never give up. Now we got to move the turp because we're going to be able to get some new uh, upgrades. Ooh, bomber boy's heading over here. Do I have enough snipers over here? Actually, I don't think we do. So that's kind of scary. Yeah, there's definitely bombs away happening. Oh God, oh God. Oh, we killed him. Oh, and he dropped them. Oh, in the back. That's a massive boom. Massive mines. This is definitely a weaker area. Oh, 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 jeez. 
Oh my gosh. That mortar needs to get out before he dies. Oh my god. And he's still going. <laughs> it just doesn't stop. Isn't that super weird? Like, look at this. This is the Burj Al Dubai right here of Creeper. How many stories is that? Like 180 or something? We are turning them back. It is happening. Luckily, they don't- the bombers don't come two at a time. That's kind of what's keeping us alive. Ooh. And what I did was I'm basically making an anti-creeper volcano as one of my strategies here to help tide them back. And look at this. Okay, we do have the totem activated, which is fantastic. All right. Oh my goodness. It's, I don't know where I'm going to put the airfield just yet, though. I don't know if we have land for it, but I feel like that's definitely what we need. All right, where can we fit it? Where can we fit this runway? Over here? Actually, maybe. Terraform. Let's terraform this whole area to five. Yeah, actually, this might work. Oh, look. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that's what was happening. That's why it's so tall. Okay, is this almost done? Can we put an airfield on there? This is such a, a messed up airfield here. All right, I think this can work. Okay, wow, we barely have enough room. All right, so we're sending out our first bomber mission here. We're going to try to hit around this emitter to kind of negate its production. And we're not triggering that obelisk as far as I can tell. Wait, yeah, I don't. I think we're fine. Okay, and we're using these special platforms here. What? Now he's attacking this side? <laughs> right on the bombers. I've got to see if this thing can help turn the purple stuff into regular blue. Ooh, big bomby boy's heading this way. But we have much better defenses now. Wait, I think he does. That all went blue, didn't it? Let's pull him out. Does it go back purple at all? Okay, I've got an idea. We need to move up here and capture this choke point. Then take this and move up the left flank. We can't just keep fighting this just overly strong purple. We probably should have thought of that an incredibly long time ago. But look at this. This is good. Better than I thought. Oh, wow. Talk about energy deficit, apparently. We made landfall. And our first D-Day invasion, our first incursion into occupied territory here. I wonder if we could just cheekily run over here. I think we can. I can move this guy over. I guess one fun challenge we could do is uh, in the future, pick a mission and try to only use anti-creeper to win. Oh, big bomber. Let's see if I can't pull this off. Cheekily get over here, put Liftic in it, and then power it up. Uh-oh, it's gonna die. Unless the bombers are here. Ooh, it's gonna die. Dang it. We need, like, one gun over there. We can spare one gun. <laughs> I think. <laughs> we have made landfall once again onto a new continent. Look at the progress we're making, boys and girls. I mean, come on. This is... I've been doing this for like a freaking uh, an hour. An hour! Now all I gotta do is nullify this guy and then move one of my terps, which are like the excavators. Move the upgraded one because he's got a very good circle of influence here. A huge one. Whoa. Whoa. I don't know what just happened there. Oh, that's cool. When the dark tower is activated, nothing can be powered in there. I definitely want another refinery over here. And I want this terp to excavate right here. And honestly, we should probably just get all the terps involved. I think there's this one and that one. Oh shoot, the blobby boy's coming over here and we don't have any defenses for it. Uh, I don't have like near enough snipers. They're all like way over here. Uh-oh, this is gonna be a nasty bombing. Terps, we might need to pull out temporarily. Look at this, absolutely no defenses. We'll call the big bomber. Oh, get out of there. Oh my God, this is, this is wrecked. This is why you have redundant systems though. Like I have multiple different power lines going around this whole area. Very fortunate. Man, I need that info cache. Let's try to put a tower up here. It should be available soon. And this guy, we'll put him here and he'll just start shelling everything over there. 